Today we're gonna be getting the no harvest achievement which is obtained by playing the map cornfield and beating it on chimps mode without removing any corn. Now recently I talked about how Giralo can help us save space and I thought let me actually put this to practice and use it on this specific achievement. So we're gonna start with the engineer in this exact spot and there are a few other cheese spots like this one by the way which I highlighted on the screen for you guys. But getting the engine on last and then getting a dart monkey in this spot, try to drag it as low and to the left as possible. After getting both of these guys I'm getting Giralo in the top left corner of the square and saving up money for a 003 ng while slowly upgrading the engineer i dropped a stack of nails just in case although this is not needed when you get the 003 ng switch it to first and now we're saving money for a heli if you guys place your dark monkey correctly then you should be able to place the heli to the right of the dark monkey on round 24 give the invisibility potion to the ng and this is gonna last for 10 rounds so we're good with camel detection for now getting ready for the lead blooms we're gonna get an alchemist on strong just above the dark monkey and drop the tube of glue in this spot so that the leads get slowed and nicely stacked for the alchemist to pop them. Our next goal is a 302 heli which you should have on round 34 and make sure to give it a camo potion on round 36 for the regrow green blooms. By round 40 our goal is to have the alchemist upgraded to 401. After this the game becomes pretty simple our goals are a 220 village above the heli we're gonna give the worn hero escape to the dark monkey transforming it into a super and then getting that super monkey to 202 and eventually into a sun avatar. Next up we're getting the heli to 402 on round 74. On round 85 we'll give the sun avatar the jar of pickles to help with the ZOMG damage and around 87 is when we will have enough money to buy the Apache Prime. Now there are only a few things left to do starting with getting the village to 230. Around 92 I gave both my sun avatar and the Apache Prime the invisibility potion which at this point gives plus one extra damage to Kama Bloom so a nice little damage buff for both of them. I upgraded the village to 240 for the ability and I placed both of the genie bottles on round 98. Round 100 use the village ability when the bat is in range of the sun avatar and that's it that's how you get the no harvest achievement with the sun avatar which is a tower that shouldn't really be there plus the added fun of using Geraldo whose toolkit is very versatile and really makes the game interesting by having an answer to almost anything the game throws at you that's gonna be it for this one thanks for watching the video don't forget to use code ethan in settings to help support the channel and i'll see you guys in the next one